Uh, hello, my name is Hatnazar and I have graduated from Calibri Astana this year. I came to Calibri two years ago when I won a scholarship to study here and uh, to do IB diploma. When I first found out about this school and IB, I didn't know anything about how this process goes and uh, when, where I will end up. And I was worried that I will um, maybe waste one year of my uh, school because I was uh, I was close to graduation in my previous school, so I was uh, hesitating. However, now, uh, when I already finished, I can say for sure that uh, I don't regret going here because the school and the IB diploma itself helped me achieve my dreams and uh, receive a scholarship from my dream university. When I uh, start my IB diploma, uh, first problem that I had was that my English was very poor and especially writing. However, with the IB diploma, we have to write a lot, a lot of coursework, a lot of essays, and this well, this all helped me to um, gradually improve my le level of English and to achieve high score in IELTS so that I can apply to any universities abroad. Except that, uh, what I enjoyed uh, about IB diploma is the freedom to choose subjects uh, depending on which area you are interested and where you want to go in future, you can um, you can make the you can have subjects so that they relate to your uh, interests. For example, I chose I wanted to relate my university to engineering to computer science. That's why I, I was able to choose um, math and two sciences. However, if you want if student wants to study business or even arts. This all is available in IP diploma. And uh, another different, uh, another unique thing that's relevant to IB is that we have uh, CAS, CAS, which is all about the extracurricular activities we do, about charities. And for example, this way I developed my soft skills. We, we organized many charities, uh, presented uh, presented uh, different. On different topics, presentation about um, about different about organizations that help animals, that help to people that don't have enough money. All these public speeches help me to be, become more confident in myself and to be more communicative with others. Uh, regarding the applications to universities. I want to thank my, my uh, the school that because we started early uh, thinking about our universities and during the first year we had uh, representatives from different universities, for example from uh, Hong Kong universities, uh, some universities from Europe, and they all were presenting uh, what they expect from students and what we should do, and this all gave uh, not only me but other students idea of what should we do during the summer. And what and what should you focus on? And uh, during the summer, uh, I was uh, I uh, advised uh, university chancellor advised us to start having a list of universities, maybe 10, 15 universities, and check all the requirements. So that uh, next year, last year, we can start uh, focusing on our essays and other uh, process of uh, application. Uh, so and I, uh, I applied to Korea and Japan, and the uh, application is a bit different from Europe and US. And although our school is mostly oriented to America and Europe, uh, it wasn't a problem for uh, my IB coordinator and university counselor to help me with uh, essays to check them. And also, I want to thank Mr. Winston uh, for running mock interviews with me. And, uh, for checking all the possible questions that the that university may ask and uh, thanks to that I was able to receive a scholarship from uh, Tokyo University and Nagoya University so and all this process um, uh, coincide with the uh, uh, time when we wrote our IAs it was a uh, really busy time for everyone but uh, we had special uh, uh, subject a PSHE that was uh, allocated uh, specifically for preparing for application and this way we were able to manage our time properly and apply 
uh, and not miss the deadlines for universities. This, this process may be hard and uh, some of you may be wondering what, what I should do. My own, my own advice for students is that you think that it's too early to start preparing your documents. I think it's probably you are wrong because it's never too early, but probably it's, it's already late. So uh, if you have free time, you should start practicing your uh, SAP, SAPs apart from IP and, and make your application well-rounded, for which again IB helps, as I mentioned before, CAS experiences make your application well-rounded and, uh, and make you more uh, attractive to universities. And so with the current pandemic, uh, when it start, all started, we were, for, we were forced to uh, study online and it was around March uh, when we had we, were, we had to prepare for our IB exams. Uh, so and this time was uh, challenging at the beginning because with, when it all started online, we, we just had a lot of free time and we were given uh, on our own to manage our time. However, with the uh, help our, with our, of our teachers, of, um, for example, IB coordinator and my ma math teacher, Mr. James, they helped us to. Uh, how to use this time wisely, how to prepare for university, as well as um, uh, be ready for the IB. And, uh, but thanks to our school, we completed our coursework uh, before the online education, and we were mostly ready for the IB exam before online education started, so we only had to uh, pr uh, keep practicing uh, with our past papers. So this is what we did in all our subjects, uh, together we were doing past papers and uh, checking with um, our teachers. Uh, and I think, although everyone wants to have offline education, uh, and currently we can't, so there are, but there are still some benefits of uh, online education. Um, and personally, for me, it was I learned to manage my time uh, properly to uh, to put. Uh, to put priorities on, on each subject and what should I do first and how. Uh, this I think this helps not only with IB, but also in the future when you go to university or even after university, when you become adult, uh, all the response will be on you and managing your time is one of the most important parts of a uh, person. And, uh, and as you may have heard, uh, IB exam was cancelled and however, uh, everything was graded on our IAs, uh, on which we put a lot of effort. We were, uh, our teachers were constantly uh, giving us feedback. We were, it was very interactive during the online education. In this way, we uh, sent our IAs completed, uh, fully confident with them. And this helped me to achieve my score uh, when, when I, uh, I got five sevens and one six in my core subjects and uh, B in my extended essay and uh, GLK. And this, with this score, I was able to uh, receive a scholarship from my uh, university, KAIST in Korea, and which is again also uh, online current, currently. I have started my second week of university and uh, my past experience from IB, from online education, is now helping me to uh, better uh, to kickstart the uh, new, new subject and a new environment.